Quick shots. Love and money, love team. For my lovely, lovely Pisces. Let's rock and roll. The cosmic egg, Pisces. The blessing. Hello, Pisces. Rambling Mike here. Going to play a little bit of tarot with you. I call it quick shots. We're going to take a quick look at love and money. Love and money. We're going to start with money, Pisces. The old cosmic egg jumped out. I wanted to leave it there. The blessing just showed up around here, Pisces. We're going to take a look and see what's inside that cosmic egg right here. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate your view. You know I do. Thanks for hitting that old like button while you're thinking about it, Pisces. And if you haven't hit that subscription button yet, go ahead and bust a move on it. Thank you so very much. And a quick thank you from me to many, many of my Pisces friends that have blessed me over the years. Pisces, if you ever blessed me in any way, shape, or form, thank you so very much. So very kind of you. Pisces. The, the cosmic egg, the golden egg showed up. You know, from the divine. I like that card. I like that card. Let's go. Money moves. Money moves. Money moves. So my Pisces. Money moves towards Pisces. Let's go. Let's go. Pisces. What's this cosmic egg about? What is that blessing card that just showed up around here for Pisces? Oh, many choices. Many choices. Hmm. Opportunities are abounding. Looking at all of your options. Tell me more. Tell me more. Many options. Money, honey. Money come to Pisces. Give me one. Star power showed up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Looks like you found the right balloon. Star power just showed up. Came out of the cosmic egg right there. Becoming an influencer. Maybe of the company. Maybe of life. Earning fame and fortune. Stepping into the spotlight. Well. That is a... Uh, <laughs> what's going on here, Pisces? Your cards... The perfect fit. The perfect fit. Finding the right path. Here we go, man. The fit with the soul. The ideal job. The ideal life. The ideal partner. The place where you're meant to be. Star power. <laughs> hey. I like your egg right here. I like the cosmic egg. Oh, my goodness, man. Oh, the old yellow brick road just showed up around here. Oh, the wealth card. Pisces, you're moving towards real wealth and prosperity. Keep up the great work. Well, it looks like you popped a bunch of balloons over there. <laughs> Bam, star power showed up. Pisces, the perfect fit. And, uh, well, the wealth card. Moving towards real real wealth and prosperity. Keep up the great work. Pisces. Pisces. A public face. <laughs> public face, star power, wealth, and a perfect fit. Following your heart, following your bliss, earning the reputation that you're worthy of, knowing that it's okay for you to be you. Happy home. This is a home base for somebody. The happy home showed up around in Pisces. The best cards, the best cards tonight. With the money right here, man. The cosmic egg looks like sources cracking it open for you. Cracking it open. Many choices looking at all your options. Bam, star power. <laughs> looks like you find it. 
the perfect fit. Yes, the wealth card. Again, another public face over here knowing that it's okay for you to be you. And a happy home. It does say home-based for somebody. Home-based, home-based, home-based. Looks like this has a lot to do with gratitude. Looks like this has a lot to do with gratitude. So you're probably been doing a lot of that. Letting source know what you're grateful for. You know, even if things have been a little challenging. Uh, letting source know what you're grateful for. Bam, man. Real breakthrough around here. Pisces. Let's take a look at love. Let's take a look at love. They got a Pisces here going to get about famous. <laughs> Money, honey. Fortune and fame is all up on this thing. Might as well be you. Let's go. Let's go. Pisces. Let's take a look at love, man. Oh, letting your friends help you. Well, you got friends in high places around here. Yeah, it looks like you got friends in high places already helping you. Here we go. Here we go. Pisces, love. Pisces, love. Oh, getting to know each other. Is there a new friend? Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Even if it's not an old friend. Even if it's not a new friend. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other. Has it come to that, Mike? <laughs> As you reveal your innermost self to each other, your bond deepens. Oh, we're heading towards a happy home over here. Letting your friends help you. Very nice. Pisces. Pisces, love. Give me one. Oh, forgiving and learning. Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past. Well, the only past I got right here is all these balloons. All these balloons. Looks like you popped a bunch of balloons or you're about to. Forgiving and learning came out. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your now. More love in your present moment. Well, that's what we want. We want more love. More love. Eh, forgiving. Releasing. Tell me more. Pisces, love, please. Oh. <laughs> Engagement came out. Oh. Getting to know each other. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Oh, this happy home looks happier by the minute over here. Give me another one. Pisces, and we're going to play Terra Luminati. One more love card for Pisces, please. Here we go. Oh, it's a faith card. Oh, you've been walking in faith for a minute. Forgiving, learning. <laughs> and then we got... Uh, uh, if you haven't met them yet, man, it could be an indicator of uh, something sweet coming in. Getting to know each other and engagement. All right, let's play Terra Illuminati around here. Terra Illuminati. That trust card can be for somebody believing for a rekindling as well. Especially with forgiving and learning right there. Wow, Pisces. The sun. The sun... <laughs> and the golden cosmic egg as your overall right here. Uh, Pisces, your cards are very nice lately. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Here comes the sun. Now, that is a card of abundance, prosperity, enlightenment, awakenings, uh, strong union. Oh, you've been going through it, man. Six of Wands. Six of Wands wants to dance underneath the sun. And that's about victory after the battle. Confidence in yourself. Receiving the attention that you're worthy of. You got a friend coming in here. Maybe you already know him. Maybe you already know him. Give me something right here. Give me something right here. Six of Wands. The sun. <laughs> here we go. Pisces, your cards have been nice here for a minute. What's that? Eight Swords. Eight swords, that's a jailbreak for somebody. That's a jailbreak, forgiving and learning, letting your friends help you, faith. Uh, that's a jailbreak right there. Go on with yourself. Go on with yourself. Jailbreak of the mind. Because, you know, we're never stuck, really. 
She could get out of there anytime that she wants. Get back up to that high behind world up there. Looks like you got a jailbreak going on, Pisces. Pisces, yeah, breakout, breakout. Here we go, man. Here we go, Pisces. Give me one, love, please. Mm, the winds of change. I don't know, Mike. I don't know. It's been pretty crazy for a while around here. Uh, protecting the heart. What are you talking about? Love coming in here, Mike. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's got the winds of change. See your hair blowing back around there, Pisces? Winds of change have showed up around here. Love and money, honey. Oh, nice, Pisces. Ooh, a six of cups energy. Two sixes. There's my little card. Two sixes. Returning to a state of harmony and balance. Told you. <laughs> Told you. Told you. Six of Cups. That's so a sweet soulmate energy showing up around here for somebody. You know, if you're believing for a rekindling. I do have a faith card right here and a forgiving and a learning. If you're believing for somebody new, this is a past life lover coming in here to play with you. It's a sweet energy. Six of Cups. It's not an evil axe. I never get that with Six Cups. It's the only tarot card with flowers in the cups. Touchable, tangible bliss. Let's go. Pisces. Pisces. Six of wands. Six cups. The blessed cosmic egg and the sun. Huh. It's a fresh start. It's a new beginning. Uranus. This is a Uranus card. A card. A planet of sudden change. Sudden change right here, Pisces. Sudden change for the better. Ooh, give me one. Give me one. Pisces. Pisces. Oh, that's ten wands. We're throwing all that down on the ground. Throwing all that down on the ground. Boom. Tower. There may be a some serious change coming in over here, huh? Boom. Boom. Ten wands. We ain't carrying that around no more. We are free. <laughs> we are free birds around here. Pisces, chariot, where are you going, man? Or who's coming charging down the road? That's that chariot with those uh, yin-yang ponies on it right there. Man, that's fast-forward movement right here in a positive direction. Wow, a magician, another hair fan. Pisces. Well, the magician manifests, you know, as above, so below. There's a hierophant that showed up around here. Major Arcana is coming out of this cosmic egg in the love arena here, Pisces. The chariot, man, leaves the past in the past and busts the move. Look at the fool, the six cups, six wands. It's about receiving attention you're worthy of. Calls you the magician. Somebody's a magician around here. Manifesting new new beginnings all around, possibly, in your life. All four aces are right there. One of those aces may have to do with a hierophant energy right here. We got the happy home. We got the happy home. Chariot. Chariot to a hierophant. All in all, Pisces. May all your dreams come true, my friend. Love this for you. Two sixes about harmony and balance coming back in your love life. A fool card, childlike innocence, a chariot as a card of victory, a chariot to a hierophant, and uh, the sun as an overall with our blessed cosmic egg. Because <laughs> it says you're the magician, my manifester, as above, so below, as within, so without. Nice stuff. Give me a couple major arcana. My lovely, lovely Pisces. Lovely, lovely Pisces. Let's go. Give me one. What do we got? Oh, the High Priestess showed up. That's definitely a Pisces card. Hmm. I mean, High Priestess. Um, that was a High Priest. Well, the next card that came out was a High Priestess. And the Yin Yang ponies on that chariot. Very interesting. Wow, and there's a Hierophant again. 
I don't even gotta I don't even gotta go look, man. There's a high priest and a high priestess coming out of the cosmic egg. <laughs> no wonder the sun's here. Ooh la la, definitely past life lovers. Definitely past life lovers showing up around here. <laughs> it's the same cards coming out. Here's these two's chariot. <laughs> Hi. Ha! Ha! Here we go, man. Ooh. What a nice, nice, nice spread for Pisces. Here's your moon card. And, uh, you know, that can talk about the cycles of the moon, huh? And we just had a solar eclipse in Pisces. Maybe some real nice change coming in here, Pisces. All my love, my friend. All my love. Hey, if you made it to this part of the reading... Thank you so very much for your view. I appreciate it. You know I do. Hopefully I've earned your subscription as one of your tarot readers. If I have, smash that subscription button right there. I'll ring my bell. And we'll be notified every time I go live. You can come hang out with us if you would like. And again, thank you for smashing that old I like Mike button. If you would, my Pisces friends. Hey, what a powerful, powerful spread. Out of the quick shots that came out tonight, I would say yours was the best. But it was your eclipse as well. All my love, my Pisces friend. May all your dreams come true. Love and light. Bye for now.